dreaming. Everyone does it, this mysterious action that takes you to a completely different world in your imagination. But what's the science behind dreams, and is there a reason to why we do it? Let's take a look into some honorology, the scientific study of dreams. Although it may seem like our brains are taking a break and resting while we're asleep, it's quite the opposite. Our brains are very active while we sleep, especially in that period of RAM sleep when we're dreaming. Even though we don't receive any visual stimulus while dreaming, since our eyes are obviously closed, the secondary visual cortex, which usually interprets the images taken directly from the primary visual cortex, which in turn is connected to the optic nerve that receives the pictures from our eyes, is in action and feeding off pictures taken straight from our imaginations. The limbic system in the brain is also working full time, which is why many of our dreams are really sad, scary, happy, or emotionally charged in another way, as the limbic system is the emotion center in our body. Plus, the dorsolateral prefrontal cortex, or the part of our brain that usually controls logic and lets us think rationally, is barely working at all. This allows our dreams to defy the laws of physics and be as improbable and crazy as whatever we can come up with. Thanks for watching! Feel free to leave questions for new videos in the comment section. Fun fact! Everyone dreams about 7 times a night, we just don't remember the dreams. Lucid dreams, or realistic dreams we can control, can be achieved more by keeping a dream journal.